Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another podcast. Men must always have a plan. And this is very important. As a man, you, you got to have a plan. You know, and it's different from saying just having a mission or a purpose. You have to have a plan for making happen what you need to happen. This is very key. I remember this young lady even knew this years ago, a few decades ago. I asked her her what she was looking for in a man. She said a man with a job and a plan. That's all he needed. Because understand something. Now, of course, I've talked about the house of the man on here several times. And one of the pillars of the house of the man is the ego. That's a logical, rational thinking aspect of a man. But it's more than just thinking logically and being rational. Is being able to see ahead and have a plan for something. Like a great example, if that man has a child or children, he wants them to go to college. In his mind, he's making up, he got the plan already about what to do to send them to college. Whether it's spending money or, well, rather saving money or uh, moving to a certain school district, getting them in certain schools, uh, getting them in certain programs, he has a plan. Now, for the ordinary man out there, you might not necessarily have children, but you need to have a plan. See, you can't, as a man, you cannot just float around out here. You can't just be like, ah, oh, la di da and all that. Now, you can let the public think that you're doing that, but you always got to have a method to your madness, even if you don't, you don't necessarily have to share it, but you need a plan. A man needs to be going in a direction. That's the very thing about a man. It's like, don't just say you have a mission. Have a plan to complete that mission. Have a plan step by step. If you're thinking about, okay, like a big plan for men, because you know on uh, these Saturdays, women don't come into the equation. This is all about you as a man. So let's think about a basic thing that a man needs, money. What's your plan to get money? Or if you want to get something and, you know, and even then, what are you going to spend that money on? All right. Say you want to get a house. All right. What's your plan to get that house? What are the things you got to do? Let me give a hypothetical situation. Let's say, yes, you want a house. You have a vision of a house. Your step by step is, well, one, you need a down payment. That's that's just a basic thing. You need good credit. Now, say you don't have a savings. And your credit is, um, let's just say your credit is shot. Your credit is shot. All right, you got to have a plan to get your credit up, get more money. So you got to think step by step, I'm going to get more money. All right, what's your plan to make money? Is it to like go for, get a second job? Is it to start a business that could make you some money? And even then, you got to have a plan how you want to run that. Because anybody in business knows you just don't go jump in making money. It could take you a while to make money. But that's something for my Money Matters channel. But even then, you still got to have a plan. Whatever the case, you got to have a plan. What's your step-by-step to make more money? What are you going to do to raise your credit? Maybe you have to pay off some stuff. Maybe you have to make some deals. And I ain't talking about having some some company uh, do it for you. Yeah, ultimately, you got to pay off the bills or you got to figure something out. And I'm going to tell you what, even with credit, even when it's perfectly paid off, you actually got to still spend a little bit of money. Just a little bit of money matters. You still got to like spend some on your credit card so they see you got steady payments. So, you know, that's a plan. <laughs> that's a plan. Then you got to think about, all right, who, who, okay, so I got my money up, got my credit good. Okay, where am I going to live? I'm going to keep, I'm going to finance this. All right, so even even uh, when you're paying for a house, anybody with a house knows there's always more expenses. And I ain't talking about utilities. You need to have, you need to not just have money pay just the basics around there before something put away for emergencies. And, you know, part of your plan could say, oh, let me raise my credit up so I can have a, a credit line if I need, if something comes up. Okay, that's cool. What's your plan for getting there? And see, that's just one thing. That's just one thing. A man needs a plan for every aspect of his life. Every single aspect. You know, what's his plan? What's his plan? And, you know, I'm going to throw the women in there for a second. 
What's your plan to actually get a woman to help build with you? And if you don't want her to build, okay, what's your plan to get a woman just to have random sex with if that's what you want? And let me just say something about that real quick. Yeah, no, of course, I uh, promote self-development, but for a man going through life, uh, you really need more of a plan than that. <laughs> just getting random sex because you really need to uh, think in terms of quality. So what's your plan to get a quality woman? If you really want to do something, if you just want to have fun and stuff, oh, yeah. But then that means you don't really have a plan. You just you just going on along. Oh, huh? Psh, yeah, okay. Nah, if, as a man, you got to have a plan. Because even when you get that woman, a woman, if you want her to submit to you or be in submission, you still have to have that mission. I want you to always remember that. For her to be in submission, you got to first have a mission. What's your plan for that mission? So it always comes back to that, but see, it always comes back to who you are as a man. Now, you got to think, okay, what's your purpose? What do you want to do? What do you want to accomplish? What's your plan for getting this? And I'm going to tell you what, it's actually fun. I'm going to tell you what, as a man who's, I got plans on top of plans. I'm one of those people, You, you somebody could think I'm not thinking or uh, I'm just playing around. Everything I do got, even in seeming madness, chaos, Rom always has a plan. I always have a plan, and every man should be there. And you know what? It don't have to be anything major. It could be like small steps. You know, what's your plan for, you know, I always talk about body game. What's your plan for putting on muscle or losing weight? You know, that's a plan, everything, you know? You got some health issue. What's your plan to take care of it? You know, you might have to do some extra stuff other than just going to see a doctor. Shoot, you might need a plan just to have money just to pay for the doctor. Or at least pay for some type of insurance. You know, if you just want a car, what's your plan? Every little thing is constant plans, plans, plans. Your time is a plan. How do you want to spend your time? Do you have a plan for that? Oh, you just you just saying, oh, um, I'm just going to do whatever. What are you going to do with this time? Now, time's important. That's why a man at the very now I used to say a man should have always have a watch, but everybody got that. Everybody got smartphones now, so you don't need a watch as bad. That's more. For, in fact, that's more for style and everything now. But you still need to plan for your time. So, I mean, what is your plan? And just work on it. And it, like I say, you don't have to be some complicated thing. And, you know, some people, as long as you know what you're going to do, you don't even have to write it down. Now, if you're one of those people who just flowing along, you don't know anything, go ahead and write it down. Write down your stuff. Write down your goals. Okay, your plan to reach that goal. But you need to get to the point where it's just an automatic thing. Step by step. You're just following the plan. You want to get to that point. But... A man, if you as a man, you must always have a plan. Now, when you're young and you living under your parents or something, okay, that's cool. Go ahead, have your fun. But you become a man when you start taking control over your direction in your life. And that requires a plan. Don't just say you got this mission or purpose or uh, whatever, however you want to call it. What's your plan to make it happen? All right?